Hello everyone, my name is Lane, and welcome back to another episode here on the Funny Pucker server. We are back. We're back. Welcome back. Um, now, wherever it comes to points in time around uh, spring, usually in that time we start something that I like to call spring cleaning. What that means, for me, specifically, is that I want to start to get some things, some projects done that I have not gotten done in a while. One of those projects being... The post office. Post office has not been actually finished yet. Um, we need to get a mailbox out to every person, we need to move stuff around, it's kind of a fucking mess. Yeah, 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 it's okay. Just moving you over to the corner. Um, we gotta properly light this place up, we gotta get everything set up. So, first things first. I want to mark where everyone's house is. Um, so let me go and do that real quick. All right. So what I've started to do is I started making more maps so that we can have a list of everyone's house here. So we have Riley's house, my house, Eli's house. Uh, I haven't listed the post office yet, but we have Zane's house, Tech's house. Um, I don't think Bell or Cassie have an official place. I know Cassie is going to move into the mausoleum, but that's not right now. Um, trying to think of anyone else's house. It's one, two, three, four, five. Well, I guess V's house is down there, so I'll mark that as well. What I've been doing is I have been taking these maps and we're going to go back to the storage system real quick. And what I'm doing is I'm pretty much making it like a um kind of fun little like outage map looking thing where like th theoretically what would happen is that it would glow um it would like light up when there was a male waiting for them I'll label the waffle in and then I'll label V's house Ow. But yeah, um, I wanted to get this, uh, building done because it feels like it's a long time coming. And once we have the mail system up, it'll actually help, um, V, for example, uh, be able to, I only need one and then we label it with this one. Oh, let's do this. And then I'm going to do my utility blocks. And I'm going to grab an anvil. V's house afterlife that goes in there that goes in there and that goes in my inventory so do that and we label it like that 
patch that up, and then we're going to go over to the Waffle Inn. But yeah, uh, that's one of the main things I wanted to work on today was uh, actually getting some of the builds, or at least introduce the concept of some of the builds being actually set up. How you doing, Jake? Just gotta go in here real quick. What? And then we're gonna take an under pearl and meow. No ender might. Good. Bam. Bam. Fuck. Throw another ender pearl. Wow. All right, we're good. No more touching it. To the Waffle Inn and V's house. What I'll do as well is I'm going to go through and list each member's place. I think this is going to be the lowest this map goes. We could do that even. Oh. And then... This one and then this one. There we go. So what I'll do is I will remove those. And then let's, do I even ender chest in here? I do not. Interesting. We're gonna need an ATM now that we have a bunch of stuff. So let's grab my light box. Excuse me, ma'am. Hello? Where did that go? You know what? It's theirs now. They ate it, I guess. Alright. So, we are going to do something like this. So, we're going to name each house, and then I'm going to go back to them, and then we're going to label what their coordinates are. So first things first, let's go to Eli's house and we'll do that. So Eli's house is at negative 5092, 125, 7413. I'm going to copy that. Copy that. Oh, it's copied already. Now my house is at negative five zero eight seven one twenty five and then seven four seven one. So both of those, and I'm going to label that in our post office. What I'm trying to do here is I'm trying to make it as easy as possible for um, our postmaster, V, to be able to get this stuff. So Eli's house, labeled like that. And I'm going to label in between with the little dividers. And then for mine, we're going to do that. And it's going to do Lane's house. And I'm going to do this. And I'm going to do that. Now, both of those are done. I'm going to do that for everyone else. So let me 
do that real quick. All right, I got everyone's cords. So, uh, we are going to label a bunch of these. And then what I'm going to do is when I label them, we're going to see if we need any mail to be sent out to them. Uh, so, for example, uh, we're going to do V's house. V's house. This. This. Uh-oh. That's a problem. Why does this not work? Eh, it's whatever. V's house is that, and then we're going to label Zane's house. Zane's house. Yeah, that works for that one. I guess the five is a little bit longer. That's weird. All right, next one. We're going to label Cassie's house. TBD. I just talked to Cassie in Discord. Uh, he said that he wanted uh, the stuff to just be sent to the post office for now. Bells. Uh, we're going to actually do Reno's house. TBD. So if it's TBD, then that means that we do not know a location for their house or they have not decided on a place. That's perfectly fine. It is not the end of the world, but it's good for making sure that this stuff is here. Um, uh, so we're going to have a looms house, a looms house. I should go do that real quick. I don't know if you guys have seen the start of Loom's house. Loom hasn't had much time to be on uh, Minecraft. She's been very focused on D&D uh, &D at the moment, which is good for her. Um... gonna do that and then we're going to label it negative 51 39 and then 62 and then 7471 uh, it's actually gonna be 63 and then I want to relabel this so let me give a loom a Ender chest. What went up here? Why is my explorer's bag down there? Uh, util blocks. Grab an anvil. That anvil is going to be labeled a uh, looms sewer. Sewer house. We don't need to label it. Uh, we, we just have to label it a looms house. That's the important thing. Utility blocks go back in there and we're going to label that right other side of this wall and uh, I'll come back for this real quick I can actually go this way and probably be better oh that was clean chat that was clean All right, so that is uh, entrance is right here. Probably go. Uh, it's this map. I know it is. I just know these things, chat. I just know these things. One of the main reasons why we added the sewer here, uh, and one of the main reasons why I didn't have it as a bit of the tour, uh, was because I really wanted to uh, have specifically 
we we originally made it as a way for people to be able to wait why is deep slate here oh alum must have used it that's fine that's fine that's fine but yeah uh we wanted to use it as a way for people to uh transport up to the top here via boat If they need to transport any mobs, they could just transport them out through there. Which I think is pretty cool. Okay, Alum's house is there. I'm gonna label that. Alum's house. Sewer. Uh, I'm gonna label actually a looms house and i'm gonna do in sewer system well not in sewer system just in sewer um cassie's house reno's house a looms house uh tex house uh and that's gonna be this one And then Bell's, Bell's house, TBD. So, uh, now that we have those set up, let me do something like this. What am I looking for here? I'm going to be looking for redstone. Is there copper bulbs in there? There are. Okay. So. I'm going to label each one of these with a copper bulb on top. If they have mail, we're going to press these buttons and that is going to just toggle them on and off. Pretty easy concept. For example, um, I'm going to prepare... I was given something from withers to give to everyone yet i have not given everyone it yet so i need to grab i need to go over to the library real quick and then i need to copy it from the book that is in someone else's mailbox that they haven't signed yet This travel time does become very trivial once we uh, get this set up. Bam, bam, perfect. Uh, I want to invite, or I think he wants to invite everyone. I've invited Zane V. I don't think I've, have I invited Zane? Or I know I've invited V, I know I've invited Riley, Eli, and Belle. I'm gonna need to take That many, I guess. And we will go out this window. Ow! That didn't work. Ow! <laughs> that takes a lot more skill than I thought it did. Alright, let's see. I'm gonna check Zane's mailbox, because his mailbox wasn't here before. Oh! So that's been signed. That's good. Uh, he just needs to put it in the book return. <laughs> um, let's check Riley's place. Yep. So I'm gonna put that in here. I'm gonna do this. Did Zane still label it unsigned invitation? Or was that just the fact that the... Okay, so I just need to... Note to self. If you guys didn't know, uh, 
if you name a book in an anvil, it will not name it, or it will keep that name if you sign it. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put that there. And I'm going to do this. So those are all going to have those second tags. And then I'm going to go through here and do all of this. All right, Eli has it, I'm pretty sure. Uh, I've already signed it. V does not have one. So I'm going to label these all unsign invitation. God, son of a unsigned, unsigned invitation. Unsigned invitation. Unsigned invitation. Unsigned invitation. So, uh, I'm pretty sure V has one. Cassie does not have one. Reno does not have one. Alum does not have one. Tech doesn't have one. And Bell was already given one. So that's how this is going to work. We're going to have these. If it is not done, then we're going to... Yeah, yeah, I, I've already told you guys this. I'm not explaining it again. I don't need to explain it like a billion times. What I want to do next is I'm going to place a, a temp chest for some of this shit that is in my inventory. And then I am going to decorate this area. Finally. Finally, chat. Finally. I'm calling you chat because I don't care. I do care. I care a lot about you guys. But I don't care about formalities. Excuse me, my wonderful viewers that watch my videos. I would like you to know that I'm about to decorate this whole establishment. No, I'm not going to do that. No, I'm going to say, hey, chat. We got this. We're fucking doing it. Son of a biscuit. Spam calls, man. I don't think the mic even picked that up. Which is funny. See, what I can do now is I'm going to get rid of that. <laughs> I hate this game. Here we go. So yeah, um, while I'm making this, how about a little bit of a story time? Um, I still remember one of the first times I ever played this game and recorded a video. I think it was one of the first videos I ever had. It was on a YouTube channel uh, that me and my friend labeled as Night Train uh, because my friend was obsessed with country music and he wanted to label it after a country music song.
So, um, what happened was he wanted to make a YouTube channel. He wanted to make a collective YouTube channel. He wanted to do it to get famous. I wanted to do it because I loved it. But, um, what we used to do is, uh, I used to record videos on my iPhone 4S. I still have it here. Um, and I would, uh, we would, like, build stuff in Minecraft Xbox 360 edition. Ah. And then we would record what it looks like in the aftermath. Um, so even back then, I was I was a builder, which is kind of funny. But uh, I hate that that doesn't connect. Excuse me, excuse me, ma'am. I, I really appreciate your presence here, and I really enjoy the fact that you're sitting here with me. But, please, I need you to move. Ah, it's whatever. No one's gonna look at it. Chad, if you point it out to anyone, I'm gonna cry. Okay? You don't want me to cry, do you? Oh, great. But yeah, um, one of my first videos was showing off a mansion that we made in survival mode in, like, a super flat world. We made, like, this big fucking mansion. And we were so, I was so proud of it. I don't know how he felt, but, <clears throat> man, I was so fucking proud of that thing. We, like, showed it off, and he was like, oh, yeah, look at this. And, uh, I think there was also, like, a McDonald's. Because, of course, there was. Why wouldn't there be a McDonald's in a... Like, why wouldn't there be a McDonald's in a, like, kid's... Uh, Minecraft world, where they're just making whatever they want. It's kind of the expected outcome. Um, but yeah, so uh, we're exploring uh, the the builds, and I remember we beat the shit out of a out of a Minecraft sheep for some reason. We thought it'd be the funniest fucking idea. If there's something in here. This is actually kind of fucking smart redstone. I didn't think about this. I, well, that was something I thought of, but that was a while ago. But yeah, um, I would go out of my way uh, to move the sheep out of the way. And I, I remember it was like a funny little thing. Uh, the reason why I bring this up is because the channel's not up anymore, no. But, you know what is up is the test video that I had. For, uh, for the channel. And that's on my, like, personal channel. So, remember how I said that, like, you know, I have, like, a bunch of old videos of before I realized I was trans and, and a bunch of stuff like that. Some of those videos are literally from my first YouTube channel. It's, like, recorded with Overwolf. And 
you could still, I, in my opinion, you could still hear my own voice there. I think that is, an, a, like, fucking adorable. But yeah, um, I've been doing YouTube, or I've had dreams of doing YouTube. Uh, like this, where I, like, I had the motivation to do it candidly for a while. Um. I've had, th I've had this kind of dream for years. So the fact that I can do it is great. I'm really happy about it. We are just over the 30 minute mark. So let me finish this up real quick and then uh, I'll be back with you guys. All right, just like that, the interior is finished. Added a couple of flowers here, some vines all over the place. I want to make it feel a little bit better. Um, I have labeled all of the houses. The only thing I'd need to do is add three more there, but that's something I could do later. Like on stream, maybe? Uh, either way. That is a project well done, in my opinion. If I stream today, that will be the exterior of this, is my goal. So, I will say, thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed, hit that subscribe button. Consider. Um, and if you really enjoyed, hit the like button. And I will see you again in the next video. Stay safe, stay healthy, and have a good one. I'll see you around. Bye-bye!